And welcome back to the second half of the Factor Uncensored. My next guest has been attracting a lot of attention for an already controversial subject, public breastfeeding. Now, Ms. Calcium Cannons has been bold about her stance on the matter. She's gone viral after posting videos of herself breastfeeding her baby in the public. She's received some backlash for it, but that hasn't stopped her at all. She joins us in studio now with her son, Preston, who's just as famous as she is, and her husband, Donald Newsom. So when you first started breastfeeding on social media, in public is one thing, but on social media, were you surprised at some of the backlash that you received? Um, I think so, yeah, because people don't really say anything in person. Mm -hmm. They don't seem to have an issue with it, but on social media, it gives them a little bit of confidence to, to speak up. And for you as a husband, seeing what your wife is going through and, and, and the attack saying she's going too far, what is that like for you? I mean, I, I've been raised to mind my business, you know what I mean? So, I, I, But you've got to feel something for your wife because no, you know I mean, she's I, reading all of those negative yeah, comments. I, I mean, absolutely. I mean, I, you know, what I don't understand is how people don't understand the normalizing of breastfeeding. I mean, it's, it's just breastfeeding. It's not like it's something that's sexual or anything of that mm -hmm. nature, right. you know what I mean? And it seems like they're trying to, uh, uh, trying to stand on a platform of sexualization. Mm -hmm. And I don't understand that, you know what I mean? Feed my son. <laughs> you know what I mean? So Preston, what do you have to say? Uh, no comment. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, as long as I'm full. <laughs> <laughs> and and Miss Candace, and let's just be blunt here. Do you think because you are bigger than the average woman yeah. that we see in the press, uh, well, in the public, rather, breastfeeding, that you cause more of an uproar. Definitely, yeah. I think if I had a flat chest, I wouldn't be sitting here right now, mm -hmm. for sure. I don't think that people would even take notice. And, and how does that leave you feeling, thinking, or realizing the public wouldn't have so much to say if you, right. you just had, you were in the itty bitty titty committee. <laughs> uh, I've dealt with it for quite a few years, so I guess I'm just used to it. You mm -hmm. know, it's. But you have to feel something because you 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 put yourself out there around the world, not just yeah. in Texas, not just in the United States, around the world, and you have every damn body saying something about yeah. you. Yeah, I think if anything, I try to focus on my supporters and the people who are behind me and who understand what I'm doing. And I focus on him. I mean, he's mm -hmm. my main concern. As long as he's healthy, that is, that's my goal. Any tough nights at all for you reading some of those comments? Oh, like, for sure. Yeah, I mean, I've, I've had my moments, but there's been very few of them. Um, and then when I have that moment, I just remind myself of my purpose and why I'm doing what I'm doing and, you know, get back to who I am. Mm -hmm. Have you ever thought about not publicly breastfeeding? Um, I've thought about maybe not posting, um, but never not feeding him in public, mm -hmm. no. And, and I've seen some of your TikToks and some of the songs you you pick. Mm -hmm. and, and last week we had some people, a whole panel here. Right. And, and, I, and looking at some of those videos, I said, well, it feels like she's sexualizing it. Um, I use the sounds that are with the trends and, mm -hmm. you know, the For You page. I just try to do that to get the views, not to necessarily say the song is what I'm doing in the video. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and so, is this your only child? My first child, so mm -hmm. I always wanted to breastfeed. Okay, I did, yeah. So and, that's and there is Preston there, <laughs> and, and 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 Mr. Newsom, when you see what your your wife is going through and the reaction that she's, how do you comfort her? How do you keep her head up and strong through all of this? I mean, I just tell her don't you know fall victim to the online bullying. Because, mm -hmm. I mean, that's that's basically all it is. They never say anything in public. We don't ever have a problem when we out. We can be in Walmart or whatever, and if he's hungry, she feeds him. Nobody comes to us and says, hey, you know, stop that or, you know. Just get, focusing kind of on reality, mm -hmm. you know. Like, in real life, is it that big of an issue? And it's it's not. Mm -hmm. yeah. and, and I've seen some of the videos. Do you think 
at some point, maybe you cross the line? Because I've seen you almost like with no shirt on when you breastfeed. Uh, actually, no. I think it was just the angle of those videos because people keep oh, saying that I was yeah. topless so and I it wasn't. So maybe it was just too low. Yeah, I mean, maybe just the, <laughs> From the our cleavage. perspective, it was too low. <laughs> Yeah. Okay, yeah, I mean, maybe the, the cleavage from the other side was visible, but yeah, I've never been completely topless mm -hmm. to feed him. But no, this is something, you're, you're, <laughs> for those women who are afraid of the public and <laughs> afraid of the backlash, what would you tell them who, uh, if they want to breastfeed out in public, and they're afraid of public and, and what they will say, what would you tell them to keep them going strong and to continue what they're doing as a mother? Right. Mother, something that is very natural, yeah. breastfeeding their child. Exactly, yeah. First off, um, just remember that your child is your first priority and doing what makes you comfortable. So if you're more comfortable using a cover, then that's up to you. If you're comfortable being uncovered as I would be, no matter what your size is, whether you're small chested or big chested, like me it shouldn't matter as long as your baby's being fed all right yeah. well we want to thank you guys for coming on the factor thank you and as she said it was just the angle of the shirt so I take yeah, that back. I was I was Her not topless was not completely <laughs> off <laughs> it was want to thank you guys for coming <laughs> to us here on the factor uncensored and sharing thank a story you. and talking about it and maybe giving some other women strength out there yes thank you that's my main goal Absolutely. Thank you both for joining us Thank tonight. You so much. We'll be back with more Factor Uncensored here on The Factor. And there is a lot of stuff right there. We'll be back.